All right, before you start putting down in the comments um, about why is he Hayes Mia, because if you look up at that title somewhere up there, or, you know. Anyway, if you're looking at that, it says five things I hate about my Miata. I am only posting this because I feel like it, because no car is perfect. And I know this myself. There are things about some cars that we do not like. I am about to put out the five things I don't like about my car. So, call me a hater, call me that. Just know, every car is not perfect. So, enjoy the video. What's up guys, Texas Garage here. And, uh, like I said, today, five things I don't like about my car. Well, let's get on with number one, the color. Now, you may think, but it's a beautiful black. And I agree, the black on this car is very beautiful. The one problem I have, though, is keeping the damn thing clean. I literally washed this yesterday. Yesterday I watch, washed it. And yeah, yes, I know, that's leaking. I gonna fix that one day but here's the thing I these were very clean and look they already got freaking brake dust and sh shit on it like what the hell and I mean that's not the paint but here we go this was all clean yesterday and it's already got shit on it it's, it's hard to keep clean and here's the thing another thing about black paint is if you try oh there's something in the lens there Okay, if you try to, like, you, you have to make sure you clean it a certain way because if you don't, it shows all the scratches, all the imperfections that it has, and it's a mess. It's, a, it's just a mess. I, I, I don't... Yes, I'm getting the car repainted one day, but as right now, that's my number one on the list. Number two, it leaks. And I mean, it will leak. And I'm not talking about like it leaks oil or transmission fluid. No, that's all fine. I'm talking about water when it rains. And here's, let me show you. Right now the top's down because it is a very beautiful day in Texas here. What's up? I don't know that. But here's what I'm talking about. Right here, when this top is like all the way to up and secure, it will leak from here and right over here. And that's one thing I don't like about it. I mean, it will leak there. Also, if I'm putting out leaking, let's go to the top back down, the trunk will leak. And I know my shit's in the way here, but right at that bottom piece there, right down here, it will leak somewhere in the trunk. I haven't found it yet, but I will find it. I'll probably replace this entire seal and it'll solve that, but it will leak into the trunk. So that's number two. Third thing I don't like about this car. My cruise control does not work. Yes, this is the model that came with the cruise control on it. And you can see it right there. Cruise main, on, off, stuff like that. Adding on to that, the way you have to keep the cruise is really weird. You press the on button. You wait a couple seconds for it to activate. With your foot on the gas still, you pull this down and let go your foot off the gas and that at the same time. I've tried multiple times, it hasn't worked, and I know I mentioned this in videos before, but that is number three on my list of things I don't like about my car. On to number four. Fourth thing I don't like about my car. Believe it or not, the power. Now, we all know after I'm doing my latch. Miatas from the factory don't make a lot of power. Just around 130. Yes, it's stock and all. Only makes like probably a little bit less than 130. I don't know. But here's the thing is, it's not... Okay, when I'm like taking off, that's fine. It takes off great because of the power to weight. The thing I don't like about it though is when it's on the highway. That's where I get my problems. Because I'll be fifth gear on the highway, 
shift down to fourth and punch it but here's the thing about that it doesn't go i want it to go but it doesn't go and i know i knew this when i was getting it but it just bugs me a couple times when it happens so yeah there's that Last thing, number oh my five, God, my Jay, most make a thing I don't like about this car, and I will point this out to you guys. This mainly happens at night, where I'll be sitting in my car, so here's me driving, and as I'm driving, say like I'm coming to a stop sign, or even just driving in general at night, any car higher than my car, or a Miata in general, their lights shine into this rearview mirror and literally come back right into my eyes. And it bugs me because I'm like, really? It seems like they have their brights on when they don't. And it's not just that mirror. It's that mirror and that mirror. So yeah, when I'm literally just sitting here, lights blaring in my eyes, I'm like, are you kidding me? And it also sucks because when I'm driving, of course there are imperfections in the road which makes the car bump. I look behind me, I see cars bump. It looks like they're flashing their lights at me. And it bugs me because I'm not sure if they actually are, or if they're hitting a damn bump. But, anyway, we all live with the cars. I love this car. So, thank you all for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, and another thing, hit that bell icon if you want to get notifications when I post my videos. But anyway, this is Texas Garage, signing out.